Try it. Hell yeah, ladies and gentlemen. Hell yeah, you go by. You, uh huh? Your boy got a new setup. This can even increase the light. Oh my goodness, ladies and gentlemen, you can see the ring light. I like this one. It's it's pretty dim. It's pretty dark. I like what I'm trying to do here. I'll add a little bit of uh, you know, the sparkly lights in the background so that will make more sense. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy making pie here and welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So I asked you on my community tab that hey yo. I want to do MCU slash DC stuff here. So some of you guys were okay with it. You know, this is going to be the test video for that. So, Phase 4 of MCU has done with Black Panther, Wakanda Forever, rest in peace. Phase 5 is about to start next month with Ant-Man and Wasp, Quantumania, Kang's official big screen return or appearance or whatever you call it. Ant-Man is about to die. Bruh. I'm going to write it right now. Susu for more. Let's watch the trailer together. Okay, I'm kind of excited. You're, man. Scott Lang. You're about to die. Damn. You're an Avenger. Yes. <laughs> Soon. Rest. You have a daughter. Oh. Damn. But you've lost a lot of time. Damn. Like me. I'm saying damn for a different reason. Can help each other with that. See, I didn't even know Michelle Pfeiffer was in this. Uh, you? Kang, let me look at you. Who can give you the one thing you want? Ooh. What's that? Time. Damn, that suit kind of looks fire. Kang, I'm excited to see what you it bring. Can rewrite to. existence and shatter timelines. Michelle Pfeiffer, how we doing? Damn. You cannot trust him. Damn. I don't care who this guy is. Is that him? I <laughs> In the background. He can give us a second chance. Damn, this looks too good. February 17th, which is next month, of course. Let me make this easy for you. Damn. Look at this. Bring me what I need. Just like ants. Or everything you call life. Damn. You'll end. Now he became threatening. In the beginning he was like, I can give you that. Damn. A new dynasty, that's what I'm looking at. You may not want her to watch this. We had a deal. Oh. <laughs> you thought you could win. I don't have to win. I told y'all he's gonna die. We both just have to lose. I'm sorry, Cassie. Damn. So excited for this. Alright, look. Kang is not your usual villain. Not like Thanos, not like Darkseid. Kang is not even like Doctor Doom. See, Kang is different. I was reading somewhere that this movie is like an Avengers type movie. It's it, the, the scope of this is huge, and since it's you know the beginning of Phase Five, I'm pretty excited for this. Now, a couple things I want to say: Ant Man is about to die. He must die. Now, understand when I say he must die, <laughs> what I mean by that. Let me explain, ladies and gentlemen. Of the former Avengers that are left, Thor and Ant Man are the only ones. We're not gonna count. The new Captain America. The doors are new. We're not gonna count those. See, Thor, he's already got his trilogy. We're done with that. He's probably gonna die in one of the, you know, latter movies, either in Avengers and whatnot, and that'll conclude his storyline. But as for Ant-Man, he has to go out in this movie. In order for Kang to be established, to have a, a whole Avengers movie based on him, he has to raise the stakes, and the only way to raise the stakes is the death of a beloved character, and that beloved character is none other than Ant-Man. And then you have the, you know, young Avengers rising from Cassie Lang, rising from taking that to Kate Bishop, to other characters. Again, I'm not a fan if they're gonna put Miss Marvel in Young Avengers. You have a separate team for that, champions with Miles Morales and whatnot, so you got that over there. So yeah, this there's so much writing on this movie specifically. And I'm just gonna say it right here, a lot of these folks aren't gonna make out. This is gonna be a lot of death fest. Mark my words. 
Mark my words, a lot of characters are not making out of this. Michelle Pfeiffer might survive, or might not. Grandpa is probably not surviving this. Just, just, um, just take my word for it. And Antman obviously is not gonna survive. Of course, they're gonna come back for Secret Wars. Oh, spoilers, damn! But yeah, man, ladies and gentlemen, I'm excited for Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania. The best thing about Phase 5, ladies and gentlemen, is that you got Ant-Man, which I'm really excited for, specifically for Kang, and Kang only, and maybe a little bit of Cassie, and now Michelle Pfeiffer. Of course, the only reason I am watching this movie, the first place is Michelle Pfeiffer. But the next project right after that is Secret Invasion, one of my most anticipated projects from MCU. Uh, before I leave, ladies and gentlemen, we also have got some DC news for y'alls. Of course, I'll be covering both MCU and DCU here on the freaking channel. As for DC, later this month, later this month, James Gunn will reveal brand new DCU slate slash phase projects. Not all of them, just a couple. Just a couple, and that'll be more than enough for us to, you know, chew on as you move to the Comic Con, which will be owned by DC, mark my words. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, see you for more MCU DCU content. I'll see you in the next one of the Zig. I had to tone down my edits, I had to tone down my, the funniness a little because we are dealing with something serious here. I'll see you next one.